There are two places where you can customize your settings in Screencastify. The first is in the main extension menu under Options. Here, you can choose where you want to store your recordings, the notifications you see when you're recording, saving, and editing your videos, keyboard shortcuts, which we'll go over in another tutorial, and some more options. Note that while we recommend that you pause recordings on low disk space, if you're using a Chromebook, you'll want to uncheck this option because Chromebooks have low disk space by design. The second place where you can customize your settings is in the advanced menu in the extension dropdown. To see that menu, click on these three dots next to the video section. Here, you can automatically adjust your tab size to the dimensions of your choice, change the max frame rate that Screencastify records at. By default, Screencastify records at the max frame rate based on your computer's available processing power and hardware. You can limit the resolution of your recordings, edit the countdown timer that appears before you begin a recording or turn it off, and turn on and off your tab annotation tools.